Good morning students, parents, teachers, and staff, and welcome to the greatest elementary school in the entire world. Today we have students from Ms. Powell's class here to help us with the pledge. They're ready to go and all they need is your attention. Hi, my name is Morgan and I'll be leading you in the pledge <coughs> to the American flag. Parents, students, teachers, and staff, wherever you are in the building, please pause to honor our great nation. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hi, my name is Esten, and I will be leading you in the pledge to the Texas flag. Please face the Texas flag. Honor, Honor the, the Texas flag. flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Hi, my name is Honor again, I will be leading you in the morning of That ends our moral science. You may be seated. <coughs> Hi, my name is Colton. Today the cafeteria will be serving lunch choice one, steak fingers with taro beans. Lunch choice two, grilled cheese. Good morning. My name is Hunter. With your local weather forecast, our current temperature is 61 degrees. Today we can expect a high of 82 and sunny. Thank you students, you did a fine job, and thank you Mr. Powell for sending us uh, such fine students. Yes, uh, this morning our st morning started off pretty early with chess and robotics and also NEHS, so thank you for participating in those. I want to remind you that Junior Master Gardener is on Monday. Our school attendance goal is 90, uh, was 97, our school attendance yesterday was 97 at 66 hundredths percent, and that is below our school goal of 98, but pretty close. We want to remind you that school is important. We miss you when you're gone, so please make every effort to be here every single day. This is Friday, and we have a celebration. So, Miss Moore, today, do we have any celebrations ready to go? Yes, Mr. Campbell, we do. First, we have Kyrie in Miss Hermes' class. She won first place in a talent show contest, and Kyrie's talent is singing. Congratulations, Kyrie. We also have Jonathan from Miss Hermes' class, and Jonathan earned a medal at the Gracie Baja Jiu-Jitsu Tournament this past weekend in Katy. Congratulations, Jonathan. We're very proud of your accomplishments. Thank you, Mrs. Moore. A reminder, if you have things to celebrate, make sure that you bring a little write-up about <coughs> it, and maybe your trophy or your ribbon, and we'll celebrate that each Friday. Um, all right. Uh, I don't know what that means. I wrote something down and I can't read my own handwriting. Uh, we'll be, um, there's pink snacks in the lounge today for uh, teachers. Stay away from the uh, asparagus wrapped in ham. Uh, Miss Mellon made those for me. So stay away from that, but enjoy the rest of it. Uh, we want to, um, at this time, announce cookie dough prize winners. Do not come to the office until after announcements. Do not come to the office until after announcements. But we do want to celebrate with these students. So we're going to start with the poster uh, winners for the, let's do cookie dough prizes first. Cookie dough prizes first, uh, the top grade level seller and winner of extra recess is third grade. Congratulations third grade. We'll be getting with your teachers and scheduling a day for that extra recess. The next one we're going to read is the highest seller for each grade level. So these are the students that sold the most in each grade level. 
in kindergarten, Miss Stevens' uh, class, Jay Smith. And so you'll you'll be coming to the office after announcements to come see me. So if I, if you hear your name, come to the office after announcements. Uh, in first grade, from Miss Raiden's class, Daniel Rice was the top seller. Congratulations. In second grade, from Miss Hansinger's class, Joshua Garner. Thank you for selling. In third grade, from Miss Sadlowski's class, we have Robert Coulter. Thank you, Robert. In fourth grade, from Mrs. Stewart's class, we have Riley Pierce. Thank you, Riley, and congratulations. And our fifth grade top seller is Jacob DeRusso from Mr. Novosad's class. Thank you, Jacob. Now, here's the top sellers in the entire school. And so, there's top five sellers. The first three are these. Joshua Garner, second grade. Fallon Ferguson, fourth grade. Ashton Bassett in third grade. And then the top two sellers in the school, they were tied for first place, top two sellers in the school, they'll be going to lunch with me and I like to eat. And they are this, this is a tie. First is Riley Pierce in fourth grade, congratulations. And uh, the other one is in third grade and his name is Robert Coulter. Congratulations, Robert. If your name was called, please come down to the front office to claim your rocket launcher at the end of announcements. At the end of announcements. When we say, make it a great day or not, that's when you come down. Next is Carnival poster winners. And uh, each winner will receive $20 worth of tickets. And they are as follows. In kindergarten, the poster winner was from Miss Allen's class, Ethan Rafino. Congratulations. In first grade, from Miss Hermes' class, we have Colson Collins. Congratulations. In second grade, from Mrs. Hansinger's class, Ian Burke. In third grade, from Mrs. Alexander's class, Dylan Martin. In fourth grade, from Mrs. Stewart's class, Riley Pierce. And in fifth grade, our poster winner from Ms. Tallnear's class is Miss Kaylee Kelton. Congratulations. Uh, we'll, be doing the, we'll be bringing the tickets to the classroom to get to you, so you'll be able to use those at the carnival tomorrow. That gives me a great opportunity to remind you that we have a carnival tomorrow from 12 to 4. And we also have a silent auction today from 11 to 6. And the silent auction continues tomorrow. These are the things that your teachers are selling, like teacher for the day or rolling chair for a month. Your teachers should be telling you what they're selling. And so come on out. Make sure your mom brings her purse and checkbook. And let's spin. Shop till we drop. Um, the library is closed today because of book fair setup. So please do not send students to the library. Um, let's see, the Veterans Day poster contest uh, ends today at the end of school, so teachers, if students bring a poster, <coughs> please get that to Ms. Bagwell or the front office and we'll get it down to Ms. Bagwell. I want to remind students that we have three drills planned sometime this week, and they are the weather drill, that's where if you're in an outside room you go to a buddy class. The next one is a... Um, uh, Intruder drill, that means if a bad person came to our school, we'd want you locked in your room. There's not going to be a bad person today, but we're practicing as though there were, so we will say this is a drill, so make sure that you're nice and uh, safe in your room. And the, the third one is the fire drill, and I just want to remind you during the fire drill, you don't talk at all. Please do not talk during the fire drill. So we'll be doing those sometimes today. Sometime today. All right, it's Friday, and that means it's Moment with Super Duper Cooper. So, Cooper, why don't you come over here? Let's have a little conversation. How are you doing today, Cooper? Good. Good. Hey, um, who are the Magnolia Bulldogs playing this week? The Brenham Cubs. The Brenham Cubs. Yes, sir. So, we, are we, is that a home game, or are we going to play them in Brenham? Going to play in Dublin. Okay, good, in Brenham. Good. Um, the, did your dad say the team worked on something this week? What's one thing yes, they worked sir. on? Uh, tackling. Tackling, okay, so that's important. When the other team has the ball, we need to tackle them and stop them. Is there another thing that you worked on? No interceptions. No interceptions or no turnovers, right? So what we have to do is make sure we don't throw interceptions or fumble the ball, right? So, and if we do that, we should have a pretty good shot against them, right? Yes, so before we leave, do you want to say anything to them? Yes, sir. Do it. Go Bulldogs. All right. Woo, all right. That was our moment with Super Duper Cooper, so we thank you for that. Super Duper Cooper, you're doing a great job. At this time, I want to remind you of our rule for success, and uh, it is when someone says good morning to you, please respond by saying good morning. If someone says hello, make sure that you respond by saying hello. I believe at this time we're ready for our school song, and let's do a good job singing.
I believe that concludes this morning's announcements. I hope that you have a fantastic, fact-filled Friday. Students, I need your help with two things today. I need you to listen to your teachers and follow his or her instructions. And if you do that, you should have a fantastic day at the greatest elementary school in the world. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, I forgot, the pig. Mr. Campbell is supposed to kiss the pig today. Boys and girls, I think we are ready for Mr. Campbell to kiss the pig. Bear Branch Elementary Time is 8.38. I hope you enjoyed that, boys and girls. Again, Bear Branch Elementary Time is 8.38. At Bear Branch Elementary, we're bringing our A game. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours.